I will show you my room. So, this is my room. And you enter to the door. This is me. <laughs> my outfits of today. I have here my storage place for my shower and stuff. I have to shower downstairs. My closet. If I open it, it will make a pair of hard time because it's very cute. And then I have my bath. And it's one person bath, which is very annoying because I have my boyfriend sometimes over. I have to sleep in this little bed. I have a little sofa. By the window, like that's something super annoying. Like I have my window, if you can't look outside, you just see buildings. I have this little wooden thing coming out, and there hang all my masks on. Then I have my makeup station. We are over here, and I have here my brushes. Some samples from a lot of different brands that I just found already, like hand cream, like body cream, and remover. Oh, my makeup, so I can spray here. I keep my makeup that I use. These things are my extra, like my brushes, highlighter, my bronzer, ring. and I have another. Face. I have my foundations, my concealers, my powders, setting powders, and I have only one primer. I don't like it here. Down here, I have some leftover lip products, lip liner. Here, I have eyebrow shape and eyeliners. And here, I have a few mascara. Here I have my palettes. I have some at home. Two are my palettes. I use the most. I have one of my songs. I also have my very beautiful palette. I use this almost every day. And this one too. It's the Huda Beauty. Desert Dust. Palette. At this one, Revolution. Why is Sophie makes that's a huge orange too? I really love that it. it has so many basic colors. I use the black eyeshadow a lot for setting my eyeliner. Urban Decay number two. That's what was my first ever made. Shadow, red, um, yellow, orange. It was something when I bought it, I didn't know it had a lot of eyeshadows, and I really love like these two, and that you have a very cheap color. And then this one is very cheap. Pretty lovely basic colors like white, brown, springs. Very beautiful. I almost forgot to show you the James Charles Morphe palette. I just bought it. I think I only have used it once. Because I literally just bought it and now he's in big drama and I'm in big problems and I don't know what I'm going to do with it because I don't want to support people like that but I also don't want to throw away money so do new my little nightstand with some cards I'm really into cards like tarot cards I don't believe that they will predict the future but I think they have some kind of good vibes with them. You're always positive, even like the negative cards are in a way positive. I really do love tarot. I will show you my collection. These are my only oracle cards I have. It's in Dutch. Very beautiful tarot cards. 
all in Dutch <laughs> because I speak normally I speak Dutch so beautiful <laughs> this, these were my first ever like tarot cards that's back I have the normal um, Rider Waits cards I think everyone who knows a little bit of tarot knows who these cards are yay they're so pretty too if you love tarot you should buy these first because these are the basic ones and you should get these <laughs> and then get like pretty ones and try to work with these so these are the golden threads tarot that's the box oh i have them back it's very beautiful. I think sometimes those cards are like a piece of art. So pretty. Look how beautiful they shine. They're flexible and I think you can put them in water and it would still work like a <laughs> some beach reading. <laughs> like pool reading. It will be fine. So beautiful and the back like with the, all the four elements like the cups swords the ones beautiful next deck is um, this my third deck it's my favorite this is how they look magician and it's man sun eight of swords I know the sun is doing them justice so bright and beautiful. See, like the world. You have like. And this is the back. Like a rainbow. <laughs> cool vibe to it. be over there my nightstand but it's not close to my bed i bought it there's no place for it actually oh yeah i have to show you this it's so pretty i have like everywhere it's the little tricks hidden around my door kind of like there is no door it's just an opening but it's very cute and then you come into my kitchen on to the left you have parts of my little niece too it's so cute just have some color into my kitchen then like my knives and everything most of this is I drifted somewhere here's where I keep my plates and these are not trips that these are from Ikea and these are things I never use my fridge is pretty empty because I just came in just some sauces and butter and my fridge here I have my pants also drifted except this one not and this is one too from my house here <laughs> my toothbrush <laughs> look at this I saw it in the store and I was like Look how cute it is. It's a heart soap. I also have a heart sponge. <laughs> and here are my glasses. And some teacups or shots glasses. <laughs> Look how cool glasses I found. Also drifted. Almost all my glasses are drifted. All my home. Back. Look how big. Cool those my glasses are. I have this little box, it's 
so <laughs> I will uh, put some footage when it's on. Shakers uh, when I make coffee. Look at all my foods that I have. I want something on this wall because it's so empty. And then this is my table. So some fruits. <laughs> Candles, I'm kind of having like a candle obsession. If I see a candle, I need to buy it. I think this one was so pretty. Oh my god. And I have now these plates with my black table. It's very cute. And this is where I keep my books because now we're close to the exam, so I have always like a lot of books with me. This is my desk. It's probably my favorite thing. I know it's, it sounds so like um, nerdy to say that. I have this basket to drop the it. And I have these cards where I can make revision cards from it. And I love stationary things. I have pens, and here I used to have my highlighters, but I have them also on my bag for when I stay at home. Also, a candle, and over there I have a candle too, like a salt lamp. Then here I have my iPad for when I want to study. And my computer also for when I want to study. I love to have one to have my all my lessons on playing and then have one to tie because the teachers are, are this small and then you have to have a desk with and the PowerPoints and as a document to write notes. So I don't like that and that's why I bought myself an iPad. This on my chair because I don't have a place for it. It's for having papers. And this as a little bag, school bag. This I use for when I have to do exam because sometimes you can get your bag stolen when you have to do exams. You need to place it in the front of the class so you would not cheat. But you have to leave it with hundreds of other students who you don't know and sometimes you have Bag so I have this bag for that is um probably like no one wants this bag. Here I have some drinks and games. I don't play it that much. Books, school books and school books, but a lot of them are in that little sack over there. So this is my dorm room. I hope you liked and enjoyed this video. Thumbs up, subscribe. Till next week, bye.